Wow, Meech. So this is what it come to, right? I'm sick of I'm sick of doing reactions. I'm sick of watching wrestling right now. I'm sick of watching cartoon reactions. And I'm out here doing this. Yeah, this is this is going to be a, a crazy video, all right? So bear with me. <laughs> What's up with y'all? This is the kid still sitting me coming back to y'all for another video, man. Um, if you see the little lighting, I'm doing something a little different. I got this from my job at Urban Outfitters. Uh, I was just like, you know what? Let's ta let's test this out for the one time. And so far, I'm kind of liking it right now. But hey, man. Um, as y'all know, today, as you're currently watching this, today is Valentine's Day. It's currently February the 13th when I'm recording this. So at this time, I'm seeing people on my timeline doing things for Saturday night, Valentine's Day, you know, just dates, you know, gifts and everything, getting it on. Yeah, yeah, I know this y'all, y'all not asleep. <laughs> uh, me personally, I've always been a dude that feels like, you know, Valentine's Day is just kind of a, a normal day it shall always be a normal day you know what i'm saying because i don't count this as a holiday because my family we tell each other we love each other every single day regardless so if you taking this day just to say you love you know you love everybody for some weird reason or, or give some type of gifts and everything that i mean look y'all y'all think too far into it but hey that that's just me i ain't being a hater all right you've seen the title yeah man I'm saying screw it. I'm actually going to try this for the one time, all right? <laughs> so, a celebrity has caught my attention. And it's made me feel a way that I don't think I have ever felt before. And it's so, it's so weird, all right? So, we are giving this special rose to Miss Chloe Bailey. All right, Lil, listen to me. I... She she popped out on me out of nowhere. Okay, I was minding my business. I was chilling. I was I was on I was on Chad mode. I wasn't on no simp mode like I've been all over the years. No, I was on some Chad stuff. You know what I'm saying? Chilling, just just grinding, doing YouTube. By the way, go subscribe to my uh, my gaming channel right now, dog. I have been posting 24 seven. That's something I've been wanting to do for ages. So it's up on that channel. I'm trying to get that mess to 2K right now. And yeah. Yeah, man no more to it but yeah bro i've been i've been just been working my ass off just doing what i gotta do and everything to just you know get these videos done right and i see this picture from um miss chloe bailey because chloe and hallie decided that they were going to split accounts and everything and i was like oh, okay that's dope i see this first one i said i was like oh e okay Okay, she kind of, she kind of looking cute, I guess. She, she looking cute. All right, say less. I see this next picture, and she's like, in this little all red thing. I'm like, oh, okay, she, she kind of popping out, I guess. Okay, uh, respects, respects. I see this busted challenge. I said, oh, oh, I'm like, you ever. For all my dudes out there, please tell me you've been here before. It might just be because I, I don't be feeling like I breathe the right way, but I don't know. That's just me. But do you ever feel like when you actually see like a really beautiful woman and it really stops you in the tracks that you actually forget to breathe? Like, I'll be like, like, like that. I'll just be like, okay, whoa. All right. That just hit me out of nowhere. Okay. Buzz the challenge. Caught me out of nowhere. And I was kind of mesmerized. All right, look, let's be real. All right, no more to it. I'm minding my business. She she posts this picture, and I'm like, yeah, she's doing it to me right now. She's doing this to me. Yo, why is she doing this to me? And then she posts this, what, what y'all call it, soliloquy or challenge or something. I don't know. I always see the words, but I'll never try to sound it out because who cares right but i seen this mess on her page and i'm like oh i'm like oh no like and then i posted on my uh page i was like i'm genuinely pissed though i'm i'm genuinely pissed though like why is she stepping on my neck like this 
Look, love, I'm just saying like this. Let's get it cracking. All right, me and you. Let, let me take you out, all right? Ha! <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? But, um, yeah, so she actually looks at the story. So I'm like, oh, okay. She, she, she seen, she's looked at the story before. Okay, I've seen that. Then I was like, you know what? Screw it. Let's have a little fun with this. And I said, at Chloe Bailey, respectful man to beautiful, successful woman, may I take you out on a date? She looked at it a second time. Now, now, look, 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 I know, I know it kind of says, oh man, cause she's probably just, you know, confused or who this is. And I think it's sure, sure, sure. I'm in this zone right now, leave me alone. <laughs> but here's the thing, right? A celebrity can look at it once and they can easily be like, oh, who is this? Oh, I don't know them. But when they check the second time in the same day, yeah, that's that's when you, you probably catch your attention. Come on, don't lie to me. And I'm and I was thinking maybe Chloe was looking at me some type of way. Look, look. I do got a few pictures on Instagram and everything of me looking good. Shout out to my sister and my cousin. They take pictures, they're photographers, and they take pictures of me too. So, dog, I was just kind of like, uh, E like <laughs> I was like E okay she she looked at it twice I posted it on my page I was like hold on she looked at it twice she ain't say no ah! and the funny thing about it is everybody started commenting on it they started like responding to my story and it was like hey yo that's crazy I'm like I'm like I know right like this is kind of weird you know what I'm saying I'm not one of those people that that just looks at like trying to get celebrities attention no nah, I don't I don't do that I don't play that mess but when she looked at it twice everybody was like oh snap go get your woman go get her go get her I'm pr bro bro she probably wants you like I was just like you know what like I'm having fun with this right now might as well so the next day I was like should I make a video out of this? And everybody said yes, with the exception of a few. Screw y'all haters. But they, like, everybody was just like, yo, go for that, do it, do it. And I was like, you know what, why not? I was gonna do it immediately, but then I was like, mm, let's let's be ease for a bit. Then I seen that we were near Valentine's Day, and that's why I decided to post it here today. So, dude, Miss Chloe Bailey, I know you are probably not watching this, but I'm a very great person, all right? I like to I like to be ease. I'm more on the on the chill side, down to earth. My mom raised me right, my sisters did as well. I would like to take you on a date. Okay? Let's not get it twisted. I don't got celebrity money, but I still got money. Leave me alone, all right? And don't get it twisted. Don't and don't and don't start asking for no for them big time dates or whatever. Because last time I checked, Diggy Simmons was taking you to Dave and Buster's. I don't want to hear it, all right? <laughs> oh my God. Oh, yo, what is up with me right now? This. But yeah, I'm just like, you know, it's screw it, man. Like, I want to, oh, I kind of want to see what's up with her because she's actually really cool. I could tell she's pretty cool. I could tell she she knows what she's doing when she's on social media. And most women don't know what to do when they do things on social media. So respect when respect is deserved. But let me put it down like this. People think, oh, oh, it's just off looks and everything. But dude, it's it, I think it's, it became so much more than that after just looking at everything that happened to her on social media recently, right? Okay, looks, yeah, she got it. Hair, oh my gosh showing off stretch marks oh my god yes i'm a, I'm a sucker for stretch marks if you got stretch marks bro show them messes i i i i, 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 I <laughs> yo what is up with me today <laughs> but um yeah so i'm just like you know like she's actually really good looking but then dude then the twitter mess happened and of course like how twitter always does Somehow Twitter in the shade room always finds a way to make black women turn against other black women. Like, and I don't understand that at all. Look, love, look everybody, for all y'all black women that are watching this right now, look, I love my black women. But why is it every time y'all gas a woman up, she does a little more 
And then y'all want to shrink her down to y'all size. Don't do not do that. Because next thing y'all know, it's going to be like, oh, it's a, it's a light-skinned thing. No, don't be like that, y'all. Y'all just got to be easy and let people do what they do. At the end of the day, the shade room and Twitter is full of, like, mid to late 20 and early 30 year old women that still think that their voices are mattering in these situations okay no disrespect but y'all need to be down to earth and realize that not everything has to have a comment to it all right respectfully everybody was just like oh oh okay but she's she's doing a bit much man like she's she's being seeking attention one one woman really just like started just like coming at her and it was so crazy because i was like yo how can you have this how can you have this much hate for one person how can you type this as if anybody cares oh wait you know what they do care now they care to criticize you for criticizing another black woman congratulations you played yourself and then seeing her on social media on live you know shed tears because dude she's just finally getting out of that shell and everything and that's the thing about disney man when it comes to disney when it comes to bringing up those stars it's almost like camp like you gotta, you just gotta, no, no, be like this and be like that. Like it's almost like they social, me they, they social media and, and, you know, regular media, media train them like completely to the point where it's almost like they're borderline robots. That's why you see like, while some of them knew how to handle the pressure, it's either they handle the pressure or they go completely mentally insane. Don't believe me, ask Amanda Bynes. That mess ain't no joke, okay? Look, man, I had a newfound respect because, dude, I can sit here and agree with her, man. Like, when you, when you're a big time person or, you know, people are have all eyes on you and everything, dude, it is so easy for them to have something bad to say for no apparent reason. And, dude, I, I will never understand that. Like, come on, like, at this point, we gotta uplift everybody, do what we gotta do. Dude, there's way too much in life to just be looking at one person and then commenting these irrelevant, like, Twitter posts. Like, and that goes for everybody on Twitter. Like, Twitter, Twitter, y'all can, can y'all just shut up, man? Cause at this point, y'all just be saying stuff. Y'all, y'all know I went on, I know this is out, off topic, but y'all know I went on Twitter to say, or to see that, Women, like certain women were saying that female rap was better than male rap. Okay, look, if you want to think that, that is perfectly fine with me. I don't care. The minute somebody says that Meg Thee Stallion's discography is better than J. Cole Drake, K-Dot, Polo G, and Kanye West's discography, yeah, this is the moment where you realize that, dude, people just be saying whatever either from troll accounts or stan accounts. And when it happens like that, you're just like, why? Why are you Why are you here right now? Leave, like leave my presence, effective, immediately. Why do you even have a voice? Like, like, like that just be the mood sometimes, man. People that talk on social media the most be the ones that are the most irrelevant for the most part. But look, that's just my opinion. But yeah, man, the way she handled that mess and it made me realize that dog like if you if somebody was to get to know her and you know figure out you know what she's all about and everything dude i i bet them they would like have like a whole new friend because she's like she probably comes across as really cool and really great and whatever dude and then let's not forget the fact that she's talented dog she made a video where she was making beats and i said oh my god she's good looking got a body and looks like she got a great personality based off what I'm seeing on social media. And she's talented while singing and making beats. Oh, that's that's a goddess. Queen her. Queen her. I don't care. Queen her. All I gotta say is like, you know, even though this is like for fun and everything, you know what I'm saying? But this just goes to show you the type of women I attract and everything. Because dog, if you have an ambition and you live off that and you know how to handle yourselves on social media, I'm I'm in love with it. I really am. And I'm not going to lie to y'all. I really am. Like like I said before, most women don't know how to do that. And it's weird. Sorry. Most men and women don't know how to do that. All right. Let's not act like I'm trying to out here and make it seem like men don't do the same thing. All right. Let's, let's not do that. But dog, I just got to say like, 
yo, like, when, when beautiful women like that, that know how to handle themselves and do good and, like, aren't afraid to date the right people, like, dude, I, I have so much respect for that. But, um, it's highly unlikely it might not happen and everything. Um, but yeah, Chloe Bailey, I want to take you out for the heck of it. I don't care, right? <laughs> and if you never see this, just know it doesn't matter because the kid still sending you Meech is on his way to Hollywood. He's going to make it big time. I stand by that. Spoken it in the existence. It's going to happen. Simple. But so anyways, you guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this fun little video, man. I, this was a little fun little Valentine's Day video for the most part, man. I, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, share this with your friends while you at it. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, the OG channel. Also, follow me on TikTok. I'm posting TikTok videos on my gaming channel and everything. I'm already at a, uh, at a thousand followers right now. So do, do that too while y'all at it. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends while you're at it. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, the o, uh, the gaming channel, sorry. Links in the description will be down below. But until then, it's the Kids Still City Meach. I'm out.